To all my subscribers, people that are watching this video, people that are new, please subscribe to this channel right now. Uh, this is, is the second channel. Kind of hurt that my main channel got hacked and that YouTube was investigating and trying to get it back for me. But until then, we're going to run this channel up to 20K subscribers. So just hit that subscribe button right now. If you're watching this video, please hit that subscribe button. Uh, become part of the fun, go part of the gang. Only make you laugh, make you smile, man, on every video. Let's get into it. Y'all know I'm kind of depressed and sad, but hey, I'm going to drop this. I'm going to still drop bangers for y'all no matter what. So please subscribe to this channel. And hey, let's get into today's video. You know, you don't you, 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 you just don't even know how excited I was to turn on this camera to watch this this again. And what I mean by watching this again, I watched the first interview, I watched the second interview, and now we reacting to the third year. It's the third year, y'all. I need everybody to just put that water down. You better but you can know what I promise you. Don't look. I need everybody right now to grab them a nice bottle of gin. A nice bottle of Hennessy. I mean, I mean, I got kids watching me right now. I can't say that. Uh, get you some lemonade. Get you some apple juice. Uh, I'll grab a yogurt while you're at it. Some granola. Uh, granola bar. Um, popcorn. It don't even have to be actually popped. Just grab you some corn. And we're going to watch this same interview together the third year. I might. It might be two parts. It might be a part one. So right now in the comments, comment part two. Because I might have to drop two parts. Due to the fact that it is 24 minutes long. What the fuck? I don't want y'all to watch me for 24 minutes. I have done it before. Y'all have watched me for more than 20 minutes. But I kind of feel now like as I get, as I like as y'all watch me, bro, and y'all laugh and have a good time, it kind of cringes me up. I'm kind of cringed that motherfuckers are really watching me for more than 20 minutes. That's a whole damn TV show. That's like watching Drake and Josh. That's like 20 minutes of watching Drake and Josh. Not even Drake and Josh. You, you go. What's a what's a TV show? I, I represent me really. I don't know. I don't. I don't know what TV show represents me. Comment down below what TV show represents. Okay, Rick. But look though, to all my good people, we finna enjoy this interview. My girl, and I think in this interview she looked the sexiest out of. She looked the. I might. I take. I didn't get naked on camera watching this interview. That's how good she looked. I, 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 I really didn't mean to set that on camera. I just got out of hand right there. Please don't call the FBI in here to take my virginity. I don't want my, I don't want the FBI to come here and take my virginity. But we got this third year. I'm so excited. I know you are too, and I know you like. Can he please start the video with his black ass? I got to do it. I got to do it for the, everybody that's new and everybody that's a returning subscriber. It's your boy. Okay. Rick, double K fan, double K gang, and if you're not a part of that, hit that subscribe button now. What the hell is you doing? Is you drinking water? You better drink water. I just told you to drink water. Water is not good for you. I will knock your mama wig off if your mama got a wig on. Let's get into the video, man. Third year, Vanity Fair. Oh, this is gonna be a good video. It might be a part two due to the fact that it's 24 minutes long. So comment part two. I'm pretty sure I will be stopping this video at 12 minutes probably or 12 or somewhere around that. But I'm going to enjoy this video every minute, last minute of it. Let's go, Billy. Let's go. And she got the green hair and she looking good. I think she got the Burberry on in this, in this interview too. She looking sexy as hell. She looking better than my grandma. Why did I just say that? What the fuck? Shit. Year three. Year three. Her sex ass. I've been asking for it, so you're real. Year three with her sexy ass. She looking. She get. It's like she gets sexier every year. That's that. That's that. That that that, that grown. That grown woman kicking in. That uh. That 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 that, that, that glow up is kicking in every year. You like. You know how me. I get ugly and uglier every year. Like last year, I was cute. This year, I, I didn't got. Ugly. I just not. I'm just going downhill. I'm gonna be 45 years old. You probably thought like, is he really 45? I'm not 45 years old. I am a teenager too. I'm I'm just one year ahead of her. 
what the fuck? And y'all come on this video making fun of me, calling the police on me, got people knocking on my door telling me what the fuck, Rick, she only 17, what the fuck? I know she's 17 and she a beautiful 17 year old that Rick will take on to take out to eat one day and eat a burrito with her. Alright, enough, I'm, I'm done talking. I promise y'all, that's the last time I'm pausing the video. Last, I promise you, we got the pinky promise. Put your pinky up. Put your pinky up. That's a pinky promise. I'm not pausing the video no more. My name is Billie Eilish. Billie Eilish. My name is Billie Eilish. Yes, sir. October 18th, 2017. It's October 18th, 2018. October 18th, 2019. Woo! I'm 15. I'm 16. I'm 17. I have 257,000. I have 6.3 million. 40.7 million. What the fuck? That's so. That is a lot. Yes. Can you? Wow, that's crazy. 1.13 million. 9.6 million. 152 million. Damn. All the searches of me. Bing? Who the fuck uses Bing? <laughs> oh God! Don't nobody use Bing. It's a picture of me and Charlie XCX. Isn't it the one about me smiling? That's a lot. Ten million? That's my face. No, that makes me feel good. Cause you cause sexy cause as hell. The most liked pictures, like this is my girl with, right here, y'all. Oh God. Are you with? Oh gee. Somebody else, but that's just me. That shit's hard. Come on. I'd say probably Khalid. Which is weird because he's like just a homie of mine. Oh, Haley Bieber, Justin Bieber, Young Thug, Avril Lavigne, Ariana Grande, Kid Cudi, Ty Dolla Sign. Oh, Tiana Taylor. God, there's so many. But like Drake, come on. Drake? Drake is like the nicest dude I've ever. What the fuck? I mean, only like texted him. Yes, sir, the sick guy, Canada Canadian's best. He does not. The sick guy, Drake. You know I mean? He's at a level in his life where. He doesn't need to be nice, but he is, you know? Being Drake, nice. I gotta meet Drake. Artist. I gotta meet Drake, too. Fuck it. Jeez. Jeez. I did Ellen last week. Jimmy Fallon. So many festivals. I met Takashi Murakami. I went to his studio. Dave Grohl's daughter did a cover of my song. He played guitar for her at a talent show, I think. There's been a lot of shit that's happened in the last year. Damn, bro. What the fuck? Uh, that's crazy. So bad. This video is crazy. This video is freaking me out. Look, I'm glowing now. Yes. My skin got better. I damn, bro. Let me turn it down a little bit. This shit too SNL. fucking loud, bro. But damn, your life, can, everything could change. Like, Are we tour? your life could change in a year, bro. God. L cover, L cover, V cover, Billboard cover. Released the album. Had a number one single. Had a number two single for like 16 weeks straight or something. Yeah. Right. Biggest selling album of the year. I have Drake's phone number. <laughs> That's crazy. I damn. She got Drake um, phone number. Drake. They didn't have conversations. Drake is nice fans, to her. Which I don't like to call fans. And Drake don't gotta be nice to nobody. That's fans, Drake. You know, God. I was so annoying then. Finishing but who wouldn't be who wouldn't be nice to Billy the though? Most crazy shows Billy is an angel capable of doing in the next month. I finished that album. Thank the Lord above because I was about to jump off a building to finish that fucking album. <laughs> oh my god. Exhausting. Thank God I finished that shit. I can't honestly sometimes I think about it. Sometimes I'm like like me and Phineas have had conversations where we're like, can you believe we actually finished the album? <laughs> I swear to God, we thought we would never finish that shit. Ever. I love that album. Um, probably like a fucking A. Ten, dude. Yeah, I love ten. it. Give fuck it a it. ten. Yeah, oh, wait, it. Give it's it an eight. eight. You're a man. I never went to school, I never got grades. You lucky because right, the school is not it. School More is not now, it. Though, Billy, you lucky you didn't go to school. Because school, I'm ready to drop out this motherfucker right now. Which I've been experiencing for like the first time <laughs> in many years lately. Turn it down, bro. Really loud. Cool. And not that my fans aren't like also the other most important thing in the world. Hey. Doing shows got a lot of fans on G. Me. Doing crazy shows especially. But I want to stay happy. That's a big goal for me. Stay happy. Facts, facts. I don't know if I'm more confident, I just think I know what I'm doing more. Uh, I think I'm less confident, actually. <laughs> True, I was less confident, for sure. I was definitely not as confident last year as I was before that. But I am, for sure, a billion times more confident, confident than both of those years. 
Okay, I, I yeah. feel like I'm probably the most confident I've ever been in my life. She leveling up. Yes, yes, ma'am, Billy. I don't know how the fuck. I don't know how it happened, but <laughs> yes, I am. I am definitely successful. I was thinking about that like earlier today because of this interview. I was like, back then I thought it was like the biggest I, it was ever gonna be, and I thought. You know, it was the most I was ever gonna be recognized and it was the most anyone's gonna know me and it was the most money that I would have, <laughs> the most clothes I'd have, the most shoes that I'd have and what's crazy, it wasn't. Damn. Success is not how well people know you, it's how you're like looked at. I genuinely did not think people would care. I. So I can't even stress it enough. I can't believe people care so much <laughs> about me. It's crazy to me. Okay, Rick I care about you, Billy. Billy, I'll go to jail for you, girl. Not safe. They they come they come here and lock I me up. Take me to jail, did Billy. Not work. Nope, did not work. Tried it. I also tried Costco, which I thought I'd be safe at, and that didn't work. <laughs> Everybody know your ass. It was like affecting me so much last year was because all I wanted to do was go out. I don't even think about going out anymore. <laughs> Damn, what but the I fuck? She can't even walk in Walmart to get her a, 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 a broom to clean the house. Um, and I can, I feel like I can say that now because I used to hate it. I hated doing press and I hated. She can't even walk in Walmart and buy her a pack of towels. Um, kind of everything. She can't even walk in the corner store and get her a bag of Skittles. There's a lot in fame that's fucking gross and horrible and just miserable, but I'm very grateful for it and it's really rare and it's really. I, I'm very lucky, so I'm so done with complaining about it. I complained about it for so long. Uh, probably that stupid Cheeto head man. November 6th. There's an election soon. I really hope everyone votes so the world doesn't end. There's an impeachment going on. Honestly, the news is so bad, I can't even... Oh yeah, Beyonce had some twins. And she still looks fly. <laughs> she was so young back there, bro. Greta Thunberg, honestly. She's been fucking kicking people's ass. <laughs> Let's get it. That can die, okay? Let's get it. It's supposed to be like, let's get it, but like, let's get it. It's so annoying. Let's get it. Stop. Oh, that stupid Snapchat filter that's like, ja -da 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 -da. I'm kind of over the whole like jeweling shit. <laughs> Everybody got a jewel. Ugly. Like smoking looks cooler than jeweling. <laughs> don't like, don't smoke, but you know, like. Uh, I'm pregnant. <laughs> oh me, on oh God, everybody got a jewel. You probably got a jewel right now. What the fuck? Put it down. There was like a story on Snapchat the other day. It was like, wait, did Billie Eilish have a baby? <laughs> it's like, what? The biggest rumor though now, um, that I sold my soul to Satan. No, I don't have a boyfriend. I can't, I could not have a boyfriend. That would just be mean to him. Uh... <laughs> I don't know. I almost had one for like a while, but it wasn't really exclusive, so I don't know what you call that. I hate things that are exclusive. Never. That's so funny. Rick up next, though. Rick up next, though. I Fuck you, me. Boyfriend. <laughs> I actually did then, but I don't now. I still am on good terms with everybody. Um, and I still have so much love for like the person that I was with then. And, but I am single. Uh oh, yeah, it's time for me to get in the gym. It's time for me to do. Step back three. Yee. The first time in my life. Yee. I feel the need to be with anyone. For the first time in my life. It's time for me to I'm get in the gym, y'all. She's single as fuck. I'm not in the mood. I might get in the gym, you hear me? I don't have enough stamina for it right now. And I'm totally fine with that. So, who knows? I'm open to it. Okay, okay. Um, I think the month of May, probably mid-May, I was in a horrible place mentally. So, um, when a friend of mine died in June, it's pretty bad. In January, I had a meeting showing me the schedule for the whole year. And I um, sat there and 
was totally silent and totally still and just tears like just streamed down my face Damn. I went to my um, garage and I just cried it just was very overwhelming and I was in a really bad place so I don't want to take it for granted I don't want to take it for granted I catch myself True. Even some things I've said today, I catch myself. What am I doing? What am I saying? What? 40,000 people? What? <laughs> Are you ever conscious that you're doing something that you don't want to be doing, but you just, you're just doing it? It was like that, because I was taking it for granted. And I that makes me really mad, and I don't want to be. And I just was. I don't know, I worked really hard on not doing that, as I said in that, and I've, I've, I've kind of held my ground a little bit. I think I've like kind of accomplished not taking it for granted. I've been really grateful for everything and really aware lately, and I just was realizing that I was giving too much of myself to other people's lives and to other people's situations, and um, I was like, you know what? I need this attention on me right now, so yeah. Fruitvale Station. Fruitvale Station. Fruitvale Station. The storyline is so heartbreaking, dude. You never, you never switch up. You never change, Billy. Let's eat. No, this I can't afford a real change. I didn't. If you don't know fruit, if you don't know that that I, movie, you better go watch that movie. It's a really good movie. Like real diamonds and stuff. Because a, I'ma break that shit. B, I'ma lose that shit. C. I got other shit to buy. You know what I mean? <laughs> I like bright green a lot. I like black. It's been pretty dark lately, so I've just wanted to be dark with it. Black is like the only time I can go through the airport and be fine. That's cool, because the airport is normally like basically being at a meet and greet. But if I'm wearing a black beanie and a black shirt and some black pants and some black shoes, I'm pretty good. Pretty good, I'm bro. I don't like them all. Like, that black make you blend in, baby girl. That's what I got on right now. Nah. Uh, yep. Yeah. I feel that there is pressure on me, but I don't feel the pressure. Do you know what I mean? I feel it less now that it's bigger in a way. It's like performing in front of 80,000 people is way easier than performing in front of eight people. Mm. I don't know why. I kind That's of crazy. Say that That's crazy. We're gonna stop it right there. We're gonna stop it right there. We're gonna stop it right there. Oh my God! This interview is getting. What, like, this interview is probably one of the best interviews. The third year, like I say, one, two, three. The third, the third time gotta be the best one, bro. This, I, I, I think this might be her, uh, the last year that they do this interview. I'm not sure, but it is getting amazing. It is getting hot right now, and I'm enjoying every last bit of it. And I hope you are too. Uh, discard some of my comments and remarks that I. I make, but I just gotta make them, bro. She said she's single. She said she was single early. I had to. St I gotta. I gotta go get in the gym right now, y'all. I'm gonna go get in the gym real quick, and then I'm gonna drop part two. Then I'm gonna drop part two. Nah, I'm just kidding. I'm gonna drop part two right after this. So comment down below, part two right now. Comment down below that you love OK Rick and you love everything that I produce and you love Billie Eilish and. Leave a like on the video. Share with somebody you don't know. Somebody that got no kneecaps. Share the video with one of your fans from you, whoever. Share the video. Leave a like. Come part of the family. You are new to the channel. We love Billy over here. And we are enjoying this interview. And we can't wait to drop part two. Only reason I'm dropping part two is because the video is 24 minutes long. And I don't want y'all watching me for more than 20 minutes. Because I feel, I feel kind of cringy. And I feel like the video already at 18 minutes. So what the fuck? So I'm putting it off right here. Part two. Comment part two right now. Part two. We'll be dropping right after this. I love you guys. Ha! Bye!